Good morning, it's Fiona Jane from Australia and I'm here to talk about my first um, challenge giveaway that I'm going to um, start as of today which is the 11th of March. It's going to run right through until the 11th of May so that's approximately eight whole weeks. Um, the 11th of May is a Friday, so in Australia we get our last um, mail, we don't get mail on the weekends, so that will be um, the last day um, to receive the mail. Um, it is a challenge giveaway, um, I do have over just over 250 subscribers, so thank you everybody who watches and I hope that you do enjoy my videos, I have been trying to work out this new camera a little bit better, I'm having um, are still a couple of issues, but I'm ironing those out slowly. So with this challenge giveaway, um, you must be over 18 years, 18 years and over. Uh, you must be a su subscriber to my challenge. Ch sorry, oh my goodness, I'm stepping all over my words. You must be a subscriber to my channel. It is open internationally um, because I'm here in Australia, so it's open to whatever country that you're in. Um, you can do a VR um, if you like to promote um, this challenge giveaway um, and that will give you like an extra entry into um, the giveaway. Now basically the whole idea of this giveaway is that I would love to receive something little, something small that represents you. So I'm calling this challenge giveaway your favourite craft. Not mine, your favourite craft. So I'd love for you to make something that represents your favourite craft. Like an example, if you love doing junk journals, maybe you could make a little mini one. Um, and Or maybe some just some tags and pockets um, for a journal. That represents something that you love to do. Um, maybe you love doing mixed media. So maybe you would like to do something like a painted papers collage or... Um, you know something else um, that's along the lines of mixed media maybe you love textiles um, like me textiles um, and laces and trims and fabrics and is my absolute love um, and that's why even in my junk journals you'll find lots of textiles so um, maybe you like to do that so maybe you'd like to do um, some fabric and lace embellishments, some simple embellishments, uh, or maybe you'd like to do a mini snippet piece, not so much a snippet roll, but maybe just a long uh, a piece that you can put in a flat envelope. Now the reason why I say a flat envelope is um, please be aware that I, as I know most of my subscribers are internationally so please be aware that of postage costs and try and keep things as less bulky as you can um, so that when you're sending it I'd love for as many people to be involved and I'd love to receive something that you know you actually really enjoy doing um, I would find that really I love receiving handmade items and and particularly if it's your favorite things that would be amazing so the less bulky just keep that in mind you know and also maybe another example is maybe you like to paint or do acrylic pours or acrylic pour art maybe you could um, just do some very simple ones and put them in you know a flat kind of envelope so that's just a, a quick rundown on um, what I'm asking for the reason why I've got these on here is just so you've got something to watch <laughs> to look at but um, the prizes now for the prizes depending on how many entries I receive there will definitely be two prizes so a first and second prize um, if I received um, say over 10 entries um, I will probably have a third prize so um, I'll make a further video um, in the next couple of weeks just letting you know exactly what the prizes are but I am thinking just to let you know along the lines of um, maybe an option for first prize of if you're internationally um, or even in Australia um, and you'd rather rather than actually receive um, a package of goodies or something um, that I've made and a package of goodies maybe you'd like to receive um, a certain amount in your 
currency for your country. So I'm thinking maybe first prize might be, um, say, $50 in your currency. Um, and then, you know, second prize um, will probably be a, either a smaller amount um, for, um, and I'll just pay that through PayPal, either a, small, a smaller amount or, you know, a package of um, bits and pieces that are put together. Or maybe you'd like me to make something and that you that you've seen me make that you like maybe you'd like me to make something for you um, and I could, I'm happy to do that and also I would package together some some goodies you know some and they'll probably be various things like you know some laces and some trims and also um, possibly you know some embellishments like uh, that you put in your junk journals um, or some embellishments that you would you know like you see here that you would put um, on lace projects so you know I'll try and make it something that everybody would either use um, or enjoy and or maybe some papers um, that I can find you know little bits and pieces of papers for those that love working with um, paper and um, yeah paper crafts so um, I'd love everyone um, as many as possible to create something beautiful that you love just let your creativity um, flow and enjoy creating something that you like that you've put your heart and soul into um, and so that I can see that I'm not going to ask for an AC card or whatever um, as well but what I will like is if you could just even on a piece of paper or in uh, um, in the card it just include some details so that I know you know your birth date um, you know some of obviously because they're making a favorite thing I'm going to know that but just some of your favorite colors um, you know just some basic information about you um, I'd love it if I could receive your address so that I could send you a birthday card that would be wonderful so I would love to, um, like I said, see as many entries as possible. The other thing that I didn't mention is if you could leave a comment below um, just to let me know that you're kind of interested. Um, it, it doesn't set you into, oh, yes, now I've left a comment, I have to um, make something. And, you know, unforeseen circumstances happen, and I understand that. So, you know, it's just to let me know roughly so that when I'm organising the prizes, I can have a bit of an idea. Um, how many are interested um, and if you could like this video as well that would be fabulous so I hope that you're having a wonderful weekend it is Sunday morning here in Australia um, and it is an absolutely beautiful day I haven't really this is kind of the best lighting I can get at the moment um, in this room it's it's not it's the artificial light it's not quite so much natural light coming in it's quite a little bit dark but um, I hope you're having a wonderful weekend, everybody. Thank you very much for um, watching this video and happy crafting and have a wonderful weekend, whether it be at the moment you're morning or afternoon or evening. And I will talk to you all later. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.